Vanuatu is a country in Oceania that boasts tons of tourist attractions and fun activities, all perfect for an adventurous vacation time. Here are the 9 best things to do when you get here. Be sure to stay until the end because we'll reveal a lesser known attraction that many tourists often miss. Number 9. Explore the blue water holes of Espiritu Santo. There is definitely no doubt that this is an amazing way to get your adrenaline pumping and start your vacation, especially if you're the adventurous kind. Espiritu Santo consists of several waterways and you can get up close here with a kayak. The stunning blue water here has been a geological marvel for years throughout this island, and it's not that easy to explain how they came to life. However, it's always a great idea to stop for a while to explore the blue waters of this South Pacific nation. Some people take this several steps further by leaping into the deep pools from trees around it, while others enjoy the quieter activity of snorkeling through the breathtaking underwater landscape. Regardless of what you choose, this is an activity worth checking out anytime you're in Vanuatu. Number 8. Weekend at Ratua Private Island the Ratua private island can only best be described as a paradise. It takes only 30 minutes to get to this luxury island by boat from Espiritu Santo, and then you have the entire island to explore its many wonders. Once you're here, you can be sure that you'll have more than enough room to have one of the best weekends ever in Vanuatu. The private island takes the form of Indonesian-styled villas with private beach access for all of them. Plus, if you love privacy, then it will interest you to know that only 38 guests can be on Ratua Private Island at a time. So, you will get access to a stunning private getaway that is the perfect escape from the hustle and bustle of your busy daily life. You can also get busy with other activities like snorkeling and horseback riding, and even end the day with a visit to the spa on this private island. Number 7. Drink at Nakamals Nakamals are bars in this area where locals gather with excitement to take the century-old kava, which is a tropical drink that is made through two distinct methods that are peculiar to this region. One of these methods involves chewing roots of the tropical kava plant into a pulp, which is then mixed with water until it forms the drink, while the second method involves drying the plant roots, which are then grounded into a fine paste and mixed with water. Of course, the kava tradition is as old as time itself in South Pacific cultures, and it has become integrated into their custom rituals. So it's not rare for kava to be exchanged as gifts on important occasions like marriages, deaths, and birth celebrations. This drink doesn't just serve as a handy way to quench thirst, but it also contains euphoric and sedative properties, so be sure you're not doing anything that requires concentration after taking it. Number 6. Go Surfing on Tana Island One look at the perfectly shaped reef breaks in Vanuatu and you'll want to have a first-hand surfing experience here. Indeed, one thing is for sure when you get to this region, and it is the fact that there's no shortage of fun for surfers on Tana Island. This is especially if you are at Port Resolution. The wind here is just right, and the water provides the perfect opportunity for an adventurous experience that will last you a lifetime. You can also head over to the main island of Afate, where there are cool spots like the Brakus, Pongo, and Aracor points to test your surfing skills. By the way, if you want to learn how to save money on airfares, then click the link in the description below. This guide will teach you how to always get the cheapest flights when traveling. Number 5. Get a Massage at Warwick La Lagone Resort If you want a lot more than lounging on the beach all day while sipping a glass of something bubbly and delicious, I suggest stopping by the Warwick La Lagone Resort for some well-deserved massage. The Oasis Spa at this resort is a beautiful little spa that has pretty much everything you need to be pampered to your satisfaction, ranging from pedicures and clay wrap to volcanic ash body scrubs and a regular massage. What's more, after you're done with any option of your choice, you can settle in for breathtaking views over the ocean as you relax around the resort's pool. Number 4. Scuba Dive Through the Most Famous Shipwreck 
if you've always been a huge fan of scuba diving, you should know that Vanuatu is every scuba diver's dream. The waters of this region are home to more than a dozen accessible shipwrecks for both locals and tourists from other countries. Of course, the coral reefs are available for scuba diving, but the real experience comes from swimming through some of the most popular shipwrecks in the world. Vanuatu has actually been the location for the biggest U.S. base in the South Pacific during the Second World War, and as expected, lots of ships were sunk there. Well, today, they have become hosts to a booming, diverse marine life. You also don't want to miss out on scuba diving through the USS President Coolidge, which is the most famous shipwreck in the country. Interestingly, it's still intact and has the perfect structure that serves as a reminder of its glory days. You will definitely have amazing stories to tell about it. Number 3. Snorkel at Hideaway Island Scuba diving is not the only underwater activity available in Vanuatu, as you can also have an amazing time when you go snorkeling in this region. Of course, there is another amazing way to observe the underwater world without going so far into the water. If you are wondering where the perfect spot for this activity is in Vanuatu, I highly recommend the Hideaway Island, as it is one of the most popular snorkeling spots in the country. You should definitely check out this island, which is just off the coast of Port Vila, with colorful corals, eels, and schools of reef fish. Plus, you'll find a shocking underwater post office box that's surprisingly still active here. Number 2. Visit the Champagne Beach Vanuatu is home to tons of epic beaches, but a favorite is the Champagne Beach, which features a lot of palm trees overlooking the beautiful azure blue waters of the Pacific Ocean. Just thinking about this place gives that feeling that your feet are sinking into the soft white sand of the beach, located in Espiritu Santo, and you already know that you will enjoy the soothing experience. However, if you'd rather visit a beach in the southern part of the country, Tana Island is a great choice. Here, the black sand beach is a sharp contrast to the white sands back in Espiritu Santo because it is right at the foot of Mount Yasser, which is an active volcano. Don't forget to go with some cash, as the locals usually charge a small entry fee which goes into maintaining the beaches and supporting the village. Number 1. Climb the Active Mount Yasser Volcano have you ever dreamed about walking on an active volcano with lava bubbling just beneath you? Well, you can enjoy this thrill when you climb Mount Yasser, which is the most accessible live volcano in Vanuatu. Mount Yasser is on Tana Island, and you could take a direct flight from Port Vila, which should get you here in just 45 minutes. You can also choose to take a 10-minute trek to the lip of the volcano from the car parking area. Indeed, this trek is highly recommended because you will enjoy thrilling views as you climb up, and you could bet that it's just not easy to forget all the molten rock you will find here. No doubt, this is a once-in-a-lifetime experience that you will cherish for long. Click here for more places to visit in Oceania.